What's up guys? How you doing this afternoon? Doing my afternoon video. Uh, a lot of people all cooped up in the house. Don't know what to do. Don't know what to say. Don't know how to feel. Cause you know, they, they used to being out and about. Busy, busy people. Don't be a busy person, right? Be a person with focus, with purpose, and get things done when you gotta get things done. So that when times like this come around, you can relax. You can sit back and uh, just don't over anticipate what may come. Uh, a lot of people are friends of mine, you know, maybe in the law enforcement community and, and, and other people that I know, they keep saying, oh, why are people doing this and why are people doing that? Why they, uh, you know, they had the National Guards down in New Jersey um, locking down housing projects and stuff like that. And they were like, why do these people come outside? Why do they act this way? Why do they do this? And I'm trying to tell you guys that stop trying to figure out people who live irrationally. People who live based on trying to amuse others. Because I'm going to tell you something. If it's the middle of a pandemic and the government's saying stay in for your safety and, and to avoid the spread of the virus and you go out anyway and you want to party and you want to hang out and disregard all the people that you're bringing this back home to, then you are not right, man. You are not right. So uh, as I'm going through this and I'm thinking about it, we have to stop trying to figure out why people do what they do and understand the people who do what they do. So it's not so much of a why, but a who. Who does what, who acts this way, who acts that way. And it don't have anything to do with other than certain personalities, how people were raised, okay, and, and their environment. You know, one thing I learned from my mentor was that environment is destiny. And when it says environment is destiny, what happens is in your environment, you tend to act like the people that you're around. So if you're in an environment where everybody's going outside and they're not taking this pandemic seriously, then that is the environment that you're probably going to act out in and think that what they're doing is okay. If you're in an environment or, you know, a small community like the one I'm in where everybody's so polite and conscientious and they take this seriously, then you're probably going to fall in line with the people who take this thing seriously. So um, I'm writing today. I'm trying to get as much done as possible. I got about eight days to finish 15 chapters. So um, we're going to get this book done. I'm going to get back to writing. I'm doing two spin bike sessions a day just to keep my mind off of all the stuff that's going on out there and the fact that I'm cooped in the house and not working. And uh, you guys too, listen, figure out what you like to do and just do it, man. Just do it. Some of the things I like to do, I like to come outside even though it's a little chilly out here right now. I like to come outside and put my feet on the ground and get grounded, you know? Take that electrical current out of my body. I like to write and I like to work out. And I love spending time with family and laughing and joking and having fun. So if having all my daughters cooped up in the house is a good time. It's a good time. It's a fun time. And uh, it's just something that, uh, hey, I got you now. <laughs> All right, man. Talk to you guys later. Deuces.